we are halfway done with the Elite Four, so I'm gonna go ahead and take the bottom left path. If I remember correctly, because I closed Cerebi, but if I remember correctly, this should be the Dragon type user. They all look the same in the beginning. Okay, I see wings. Alright, this has to be the dragon, because I know the last one isn't dragon. I think the last one is water. This does not look like a water one, so this has to be the dragon one. Oh, wow. That is sick. Just like a calm, but spooky, strong appearance. I don't know. Is that her earrings? Those are huge if those are her earrings. That's just wonderful news. Facing opponents like you and your team will make my Pokemon grow like weeds. It, I swear that's her earrings. Yeah, they are. They're not directly connected, though. They're, like, connected. At least I think they are. Alright, so she starts off with a Dragalge. Dragalge? I don't know, but it is a Poison and Dragon-type Pokemon. And the whole point of her sending that off first is, with the introduction of Fairies, they want you to send out a Fairy-type. And her Poison-typing will easily wipe out Fairies. So that's why I don't recommend you bringing Fairies. Bring an Ice or Dragon-type. But if you, if you can take out Dragalge over here, then fairies can take out the rest of the Pokemon. I remember the leaker or something said that Drudagon actually got a Mega Evolution, but they never sh like they found his Mega Stone. I don't know Drudagate or something, but they never found one in the game. I found one in the game. All right, Moonblast. So Xerneas over here can take out the rest of the Pokemon. It's only that Dragolge in the beginning. And as long as you can outspeed their dragon, you can send out your own dragon. Because in the end, it's all about outspeeding. Because even though you might be stronger, if they're not as strong, then you can take them out in two hits. Alright, that wipes out Alteria. So she's down to her last Pokemon, Noivern. Which doesn't even look anything like a dragon. Unless I'm not looking at him correctly. No, he does not look like a dragon. I mean, if Aerodactyl is not good enough to become a dragon, even in his Mega Evolution, then you shouldn't even be. Look, he sucks with dragon moves. He's like an impersonator. He outsped me, but he still couldn't beat my Garchomp. Oh dear me, that was a quick battle. I do hope you'll come back again sometime. Somebody tell me if those are earrings. I'm so curious. That'd be heavy. Should be lifting weights to their ears. Oh, you, you're too much. You and your Pokemon are simply charming. Is that really all you want to say? Oh, wait, there's more. <laughs> oh, wow, I didn't even know that. Oh, you're going already? Farewell, then. With your Pokemon, I'm sure you can beat the last of us. Well, anyways, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like, and in the next episode, we're going to take on the final Elite Four member.